There's, here's a quick demo on the on the iOS experience for Remote Assist. So I'm going to check this box for the device. I'm going to click Remote Assist. And so at this point, it's sending a push notification to my iOS device. And at this point, what you it tells you it wants you to broadcast your screen. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do that. You see it's authorizing the connection, it's gonna say connecting to the device. You'll see here it talks about how you can only view the screen. It's okay, so we have our device here. So let's look at and talk about what you can see. So in the device summary, you get your typical stuff. You get a bunch of information in here, which is neat. You can see your screen sharing info. So you can see here, you only get this, the screen share button, screen share option. You know which has, you know which has uses, right? So you can you can be able, you're able to do some stuff with that just by you know being able to do that. So you know you can. So if we go back to the screen share, you see we're just looking at Mobile John website, how it's doing today. You know it's just your your straightforward basic thing, and it's really simple and easy, not at all hard. And that's kind of what you get yourself with. You also have the ability to, as well, as you can snapshot, you can record. See, so we're going to record the screen. Like, what do we want to see? Yada, yada, yada. And then we just see that. And look at that. It gives me a little video. And, you know, it just kind of gives you an idea. You know, you can snapshot. So there are definitely some great uses on iOS. It's a lot more simplistic. You don't get as much as you get with a PC, but it still really solves a problem and helps you solve that problem in real time with a much better delay than anything I've ever seen. Thanks and have a good day.